Many students have returned to classrooms this month for the first time in nearly a year. It's something that can be exciting for some, but full of anxiety for others since classrooms look completely different these days. Good morning, El Paso's Madeline Audley joins us live now with tips for parents to make that adjustment a little easier. Good morning. Good morning. Throughout the pandemic, learning like this through a screen has become the new norm. It's why a local psychologist says it's normal. Just says it's normal that kids might feel afraid to go back to a classroom with other people in a room like this one. But there are some ways that parents can help. Communication, transparency, establishing a routine, answering their questions, and then, you know, just revamping as you go. If, if things aren't working, talk to them. Talk to them at the end of the day. How did it go? What were worries that you had? Um, and try to see what maybe you can change. Dr. Melanie Longhurst says parents can even find out what the school day will look like and then walk their children through it before actually sending them back. If there are chances to practice new routines at home, like wearing a face mask, that can help too. She recommends parents make sure children understand how the virus spreads in a developmentally appropriate way. Teaching them safety precautions will then not only keep them safe, but also help to give them a sense of control. Dr. Longhurst adds it's also important that parents try to stay calm themselves because children can often feed off the worries that they see from their families. Reporting live, Madeline Otley, Good Morning El Paso.